are live in the Hefter Media Labs with Zach Newmark, Caleb Gassner, and we're learning Sefer Pitu Chechotam from Rabbeinu Yaakov Avi Chatzira. Zecher Tzadik V'Kadosh Levracha. It is Parshas Emor. What an awesome Parsha. We start with the Kehanim, we talk about Karbanas, and then Yom Toivim. Oh, I'm so excited. Within these parshas, we have a beautiful command: "V'chi sizbachu zevach toyd el Hashem liret soinchem tizbachu." Halachas are bringing a carbon. Here it's talking about a carbon toyd that's got to be brought liret soinchem. It's got to be. You have to be interested in bringing it. It's got to be awesome. But Yemahu on that day, you actually have to eat it. Loi say siru menu arbeiker. Do not wait until the next morning because if you do, it becomes nicer. Ushmarta mitzvahisa, I keep my mitzvahs vasisam oisam, and do them on Yeshem. Seems like a little bit of a random commandment in the middle here. Veloises chalu Hashem kachi, do not disgrace my name. The mitzvah of chil Hashem, v'niktashi b'teich b'nei Yisrael, the mitzvah of Kiddush Hashem. Hashem says, Hamaitzi eschem e'er t'shem, because I've taken you out of Egypt. Liyos lachem le'likim ani Hashem. Ben Yaakov, seeing Karbanas, he wants to clue us in here to some halachas, or to the concepts of tefillah, because as we know, tefillah, b'makayim carbon. The Medrash Rabbah tells us in the Pasuk, in Hosea, kol titza avayin, v'kach toiv, if you're carrying sin, take toiv, take goodness, u'nishal ma'parim svaseinu, and allow our lips to be a fulfillment for our cows. What does that mean? That through our lips we're able, we can't bring karbanas, but we can daven Amri Yisrael Rabbi Shlom Klaus Rabbi Shlom Bizman Shabbos Hamikdash Kaim as long as the Bais Hamikdash is around Hayinu Makriv and Carbon we could bring a Carbon Umeschaper and attain forgiveness the Achshav now Ein Biyadenu Ela Tefila all we have is Tefila Tefila comes in place of Carbonus Unishal Maparm Svasenu that is many aspects to it. There's one aspect of saying karbanas. It's through us learning and saying karbanas in the morning. It's as if we brought the karbanas. But also, davening itself is b'makam karbon. So there are three halachas specifically, or three ideas specifically that are in Yaakov Mahon um, in comparing tefillah and karbanas. Halachas, concepts we find by a carbon that apply to tefillah as well. And if we want our tefillah to be accepted, then we have to view, hey, you know, this is like a carbon. So if there are halachas and tanaim conditions that need to be fulfilled for a carbon to be accepted, then we got to apply that to tefillah as well. So he talks here specifically about three. L'rasayin, zman, and tzibur. So let's see how he's maramis to these three ideas in our psukim. Number one, tefillah has to be l'rasen. There's got to be desire. It's got to be with excitement. With uh, you know, this is something I, I'm actually interested in doing. I'm not being forced to do. When you brought a carbon, you couldn't force someone to bring a carbon. A carbon had to be brought l'rasen, and here too as well. It's got to be done l'rasen. So when you bring a carbon, tefillah's connected carbonus l'ritzayin chem tizbachu. Our tefillah, it's so hard because we do daven every day and davening can be got a drag and there's a component here. It needs to be l'rasin. Take time. Take a moment before you stop. Here, I'll give an opportunity to daven to the Rabbani Shalalem, to daven to the master of all. L'rasin. This is good for me. This is something I want to be doing. Let our tefillah be l'rasin. Bayeimahu yeyeachel. Now, this is something that gets a little bit tricky because davening has specific times, just like Karbanas had times. Karbanas had specific times when they needed to be brought, and Karbanas had specific times when they needed to be eaten. And that was it. Once that time was over, eh, the is no good. The carbon was no good. So you may say, you know what? All right, so I won't daven now. There's always, I can always get mincha. I'll daven later. There's even a concept of tashlumen. If I miss one, I can make it up. Comes along the pasuk and tells us, "By Yom Bahu, on that day, make sure you get each tefillah at its proper time." Lisa Yisiru Imenu Adbaker. 
there's a concept of over yaime once a day passes batal karbani you know if you didn't bring the carbon tamid on monday you couldn't bring two on tuesday over yaime batal karbani once a day passes the carbon is over you missed it it's void and it becomes nicer leftovers who likes leftovers? So actually, when I went to Eretz Yisrael to learn, I actually learned to enjoy leftovers. But it was other people's leftovers, so that was like fresh for me. But your own leftovers, you know, it's an avoda. Every man, married man, needs to know he can eat leftovers. But it's leftovers. It's still called leftovers. A tefillah that's left over. Nah. If we want it to be l'ratzen, we got to do it at its right time, at its right space. Ushpartem mitzvaisai. Now we'll be asking for like, what's this pasuk doing? Keep your mitzvahs. Rabbi Yaakov says this is amazing. You know, when you daven, especially shacharis, when you say kriyishma, you daven shemun esrei. Um, you're supposed to be muutaf. You're supposed to be wearing tzitzis and tefillin. And uh, Rabbi Yaakov brings from the Arizal that it needs to be uh, with tzitzis and tefillin. It's, you're davening. It, it's it needs to be with it. The word mitzvaisai, look at these Rashi Tevis, mem tzadik vav saf and yud, mu'utafim, you gotta be shame of this, that you're mu'utaf, you're enwrapped in tzitzes and tefillin yachtov. Rashi Tevis mitzvaisai, watch, mishmartim, keep those mitzvahs. And when you do these things, chavra, when we keep, when we dive in l'ratzayin, and uh, we dive in bizman, and we dive with our tzitzes and, tf- and tefillin, oh, then Hashem says, v'asisim oisam, it's like you brought a carbon. That comes kapara. One more item. You know what Sabmar says? If you live in a place where there's a shul and you don't go to it, we have a special um, privilege to daven b'tzibur. Something that was taken away from us for a, for a while. And we have the opportunities given back to us to daven b'tzibur. Which never be chasashal mechil Hashem. V'leisachalu S says Rabbi Yaakov. What's the S coming to add? S Rashi Tevis Tvilas Echad Chil Hashem. When you're able to daven b'tzibur, you daven by yourself. Rather than ikdashi b'seich b'nei Yisrael, let that carbon, let that tefillah be brought amongst Kal Yisrael. Not only do you get all the dvarim shabikdusha of Baruch Hu and Kaddish and Chazar Shashatz Kedusha. The Nikdashi, we got to sing the Vekarish Baruch Hu's name. But Davening B'tzibur itself is a Kiddush Hashem. So we have a wonderful opportunity to improve our tefillah, something we do three times every day. And take one of these to be Machazakin, whether it be Davening Bizman, making more of an effort to feel a ruts and I want to be here, I want to do this tefillah. Make more of an effort to Daven, make a tefillah B'tzibur, and let's have an awesome Kiddush Hashem with a wonderful Shabbos Kiddush. All the best.